Good night. I have selected three. Um, good night. I have selected selected three pictures for you. Let's take a look at them. Uh oh, wrong button. Yep. Can you tell what kind of disorder they have? Do they look like ordinary kids for you? Well, most of them do, but all of these kids are within the autism spectrum. What? Yep. It can take some years until a person is identified as autistic. It took my family some years. Lots of appointments to doctors and specialists and w until was I was diagnosed. I'm 14 and I have Asperger. Today, I'm going to talk about autism. But what is autism? Yep. The autism spectrum is a range of neurodevelopmental disorders, which includes autism. Autism is a disorder that affects a lot of people in their daily lives, and you might not even know who's under the situation. Even the same types of autism has differences between person to person. And autism is es estimated to affect 1% of people, and males are diagnosed more often than females. Autism affects people on their social skills and have restricted and repetitive behavior and is commonly noticed in one to two years of age. But how do they feel? It's hard to know how they feel. Most of them have difficulty identifying their feelings and don't, don't understand the facial express, expressions and avoid eye contact. Some of them are completely nonverbal and stay like that for their whole lives. But there are patterns to knowing how they feel. It's on their behavior, but like I said, it differs a lot from person to person. But what can we do about it? If you're a parent, it's a good, I it's a good idea noticing there's something wrong, re wrong and getting the diagnostic. It's also a good idea to accept your child has autism. Ignoring it will only make it worse. So if you accept it, you can help your child get better through the means of therapy and psychology. Another thing is doing your best to talk to them. Talk about their interests, about what they like. If you, even if it doesn't seem like they're trying hard to talk to you, remember that they have difficulty socializing. Another thing is being patient. They get frustrated easily, so let them take their time. The thing is that they also don't like noise, so try to not be loud around them. Another thing is not ignoring them when they don't like being ignored. Another thing is not making fun of them they already have emotional difficulty, so don't make it worse for them. Always try to help them, no matter who it is. You, m you might not even know who's under the situation. Thank you. Okay.